530 starts right now. Good evening. We begin tonight with street racing. That's what several law enforcement agencies says create or said created havoc on the highway and kept them rather busy last night. Yeah, they spent hours tracking down drivers who were allegedly racing and destroying property. Our Lisa Barrera with more on the roundup operation that led to multiple arrests, some thanks to posts made online. Good afternoon. Well, the big lesson is that nothing posted on social media is actually private. These posts were really specific on time and location, making it easy for agents to spot these drivers and catch them in the act. However, it was still a big task as hundreds of drivers took the streets. Agencies including SAPD Special Crimes, DWI and Tactical Response Units, as well as Eagle Helicopter, along with Bear County Sheriff's Office, started the roundup around 8 last night and worked overnight. Investigators say those involved race on the interstate and frontage roads, did burnouts and spun donuts in parking lots and destroyed property. On your screen, you'll see some of the young drivers arrested across San Antonio, including at Roosevelt and Military Drive, Marbuck Road and Loop 410, Ingram and Loop 410, Highway 151 at Callahan and 281 at Bassey. According to police, the street racers were competing with other major cities in Texas to see who could create the most panic on the roads. And this isn't the first incident of its kind here in San Antonio. According to SAPD, last month, hundreds of drivers also shut down highways to commit the same acts and even started fires on the highway. Police say they don't have an exact head count just yet of how many arrests were made last night, but they do know that these charges range from street racing to DWI, destruction of property, and possession of a firearm or drugs. Reporting Alicia Barrera, KSAT 12 News.